Hello everyone, welcome to another exciting episode of my channel. Today, we are diving into some mind-bending logic puzzles straight from the Sigma QE test 2024. These are the kinds of questions that really test your critical thinking, and we're going to break them down one by one. So, grab a pen, paper, and let's get started. Question 61. A quiz show presenter will read out letters sent in by viewers. Letter B is read first, then letter C, but not as the opening letter. Letter A will be read towards the show's end, but not in the closing session. Letter C and F are read sequentially between letters E and D. Which letter will be read at the end of the program to conclude? Take a moment to think about it. You can pause this video and try to get the correct answer. Okay, have you found the answer? Let's analyze the sequence. We know B is read first. We can write it down here. Then letter C, but not as the opening letter. C, letter C and F are read sequentially between letters E and D. So it should be E and D. Letter A will be read towards the show's end, but not in the closing session. So the letter D will be read at the end of the program. Moving on to question 62. Triploca is an application to order travel tickets and hotel rooms. Ordering two weeks earlier before departure, through Triploca will receive a special discount, while an order a week before departure will receive the general discount. There are no other discounts. If Jenny ordered a ticket one month prior to the departure, the correct statement is Jenny would receive the special discount. Jenny would receive a super discount. Jenny would receive the general discount. Jenny would receive a special discount or Jenny would not receive any discount. What do you think? Hit the pause button on this video and see if you can nail the right answer. Okay. Now, according to the rules, you only get a special discount if you order two weeks before departure. Two weeks and special discount. And then, while well, an order week before departure will receive the general discount. One week, general discount. And there are no other discount. So if Jenny ordered a ticket one month prior or before to the departure, Jenny would not receive any discount. Yeah. Number 63. Rain poured down on each Jakarta last night. This rain poured down as the impact of artificial rain in Bogor. Suwarno's house was showered with rain last night. The correct statement is Suwarno's house in, is in Bogor. The rain at Suwarno's house was artificial rain. Suwarno's house is unknown. Suwarno's house is in East Jakarta. The rain at Suwarno's house did not happen. Pause this video for a moment and see if you can figure out the correct answer. Now we know there was artificial rain in Bogor, but we are not given enough details about where Suwarno's house is located. It could be in Bogor or East Jakarta or somewhere else entirely. Since we cannot determine Suwarno's location, the best answer is Suwarno's house is unknown. Okay, 
Question 64. If students are tired of studying for exams, they will often get angry. People who are often angry will be avoided by their families. Based on the statements above, the correct conclusion is exam season must be avoided in order for students not to get mad. Students will be avoided by their family. Students are angry because they are tired. Students who are often angry will be avoided by their family or students who are tired of studying must be avoided. Take a moment to pause this video and see if you can come up with the correct answer. Okay, the key here is that students who are tired of studying tend to get angry here. So, angry people are avoided by their family. So, the conclusion we can make is that students who are often angry will be avoided by their family. Which one? Mm. Oh. Students who are often angry will be avoided by their family. 65. Jumbo jet airplanes have a maximum landing weight. This weight is the total weight of the aircraft minus the weight of the fuel. A violation of this provision will result in the aircraft's landing gear to break due to inability to withstand the pressure. If an aircraft of this type lands at its destination safely after being in the the air for only a few minutes. The correct conclusion is the airplane landed with very little fuel remaining. This type of airplane has stronger landing gears. The airplane departed with fuel that was not fully really filled. The airplane's technical damage made it lighter. Or the airplane was not the jumbo jet type being discussed. Go ahead and pause this video for a second and see if you can figure out the right answer. Okay, since the airplane only flew for a short time, for a short time, for a few minutes, um, it's likely still had a lot of fuel, but it managed to land safely. Which means it was within its landing weight limit. The most likely explanation is that is landed with very little fuel remaining. So the correct answer is the airplane landed with very little fuel remaining. The text did not say it about uh, the technical damage made it larger or about the landing gears strong or not. And this option is also wrong because it said the airplane was not the jumbo jet type. But in the question, in this question, if an aircraft of this type, it refers to jumbo jet airplanes. The airplane departed with fuel that was not fully filled, but we don't know. Is it ninety percent? 80% or 5%? We don't know. But here's the, the key for only a few minutes. And this is maximum landing weight. The weight is the total weight of the aircraft minus the weight of the fuel. So the airplane landed with very few, little fuel remaining is the answer. Okay. So, yeah. And that wraps up today's set of challenging questions. Remember, the key to mastering this test is practicing and understanding the logic behind each question. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and ring the notification bell so you never miss out.
on new content. Thank you for watching and keep challenging your mind. Goodbye.